Hello, my name is Jackie Marsing. I'm a registered histologist and have worked in this field for the last 26 years. I'm here to introduce a new product called the Cryo Embedder. It's used for embedding frozen sections. The Cryo Embedder is the fastest procedure available. It's efficient, convenient, and it produces a much higher quality slide. There is a procedure referred to as cryogenics, which is the preparation of fresh frozen tissue for microscopic viewing. Its effectiveness is the fact that the results are instantaneous and disease can be detected right away. However, with the current techniques, there is room for error. While old methods appear to be adequate, the industry is plagued with problems that can compromise the pathologist's ability to give a diagnosis. The cryo better eliminates the following problems. When tissue is not oriented properly, the wrong area of the specimen can be viewed. When tissue is frozen too quickly, it can create crystal artifact. Working with liquid nitrogen and freezing tissue to glass slides can be dangerous to the technician. Trimming a block down to obtain full face sections can waste precious tissue. This is a stat procedure and needs to be completed with as much efficiency and speed as possible. The cryo better is the fastest procedure available. It's efficient, convenient, and it produces a much higher quality slide. When a trained technician properly uses the cryo better, the results can be dramatic. After the specimen is received, we can begin the embedding process. The embedding process has now been completed and the specimen is ready for cutting. The cryo embedder consists of a cutting board, eight flat steel buttons, a button holder, a trimming tool, the embedding device, and three adapters. The cutting board is designed with a groove down one side to accommodate instruments. On the other side are eight holes to accommodate the eight flat orientation buttons. The eight steel buttons are used to orient the tissue on a flat plane. The button holder has many uses. It can be kept down in the chamber for preparation of the embedding buttons. It can also be used for multiple sections when embedding several pieces at a time. It can also be taken outside the chamber and retain its temperature for several minutes while embedding multiple pieces. It is also used as an organizer. The embedding device conducts the temperature of the chamber through the steel button into the tissue. It can also be held at eye level so the technician can view it properly while orienting the tissue onto the flat button. The device is precision designed for perfect alignment. The embedder, along with its adapters, can be used for all makes of cryostats. Zeiss, Leica, IEC, Shandon, and Tissue Tech. This technique enhances the embedding of all frozen tissue. We'll now see this procedure step by step. Place the tissue specimen on the flat button, cut side down. Tease the edges of the specimen down on the flat button. Insert the appropriate base button on the bottom portion of the device. Apply the mounting medium over top of the specimen. Place the top portion of the device holding the specimen over on top of the bottom portion of the device. Freeze the mounting medium. Remove the top portion of the device and separate the flat button from the tissue. The specimen is now ready for cutting. 
When orienting vertical biopsies, apply it to a cold button and surround it with mounting medium and freeze it before turning the button over. For large specimens and fatty tissue, be sure and build up the mounting medium for support. Trimming away the excess mounting medium allows you to apply more sections per slide. The cryo-embedder technique enhances the quality of surgical biopsies, needle biopsies, punch biopsies, and all dermatology specimens. The cryo better is the fastest procedure available. It's efficient, convenient, and it produces a much higher quality slide. The cryo better is adaptable to all makes of cryostats. It's small enough to fit down inside the cryostat chamber. It maintains its freezing temperatures through the conducting of the cryostat chamber into its aluminum composition, not through the use of liquid nitrogen. The precision design assures exact alignment in bedding and spares tissue loss. It eliminates crystal artifact through temperature infiltration versus flash freezing. It can be held at eye level while orienting the tissue for embedding, thus ensuring complete margins. It increases speed with the ability to embed up to eight specimens at a time. This procedure does not require the use of precious counter space. It does not require the use of dangerous open containers of liquid nitrogen. It provides a system for organizing unlabeled patient specimens. Its simplicity enables uncomplicated instructions. It delivers more accurate test results faster. Everyone that has been introduced to the cryo better system has been impressed with the quality of the results. The cryo better is a wonderful tool for most surgeons. It speeds the process of mounting tissue. It helps me to get a complete skin edge on my first sections better than any technique I have ever used. It also helps me to get the skin edges laid down without them rolling. I highly recommend the cryo and better for any Mohs surgeon, which I believe will help all Mohs surgeons to get better results and more accurate results. I've been using the cryo and better for about a year now. When I learned the procedure, I was amazed at how easy and simple it was to use. Using the cryo and better has allowed me to process slides more rapidly and more accurately. Patients spend less time waiting for results which makes our surgery days more effective and more efficient. Now that I've used the cryo and better, I couldn't imagine using any other method for tissue preparation. I think the cryo and better represents a significant step forward in the processing of frozen tissue, both for the technician and for the physician. For the technician, it helps them get perfectly flat margins the first time around. For the physician, it means that there will be fewer slides to look at and that the accuracy in examining the entire margins of the specimen will be much greater. I've used the cryo and better for over two years now and I can truthfully tell you that I don't think that I would ever go back to another system. This technique is easy to learn. It's fast, it's accurate, it improves the quality of the slides for diagnosis and it promotes safety in the lab. The cryo and better system 
It's practical, it's cost-effective, and it works.